The Hessian Ludwig Railway German, Hessisch Ludwigsbahn or HLB with its network of 697 km of railway was one of the largest privately owned railway companies in Germany. Early history The Hessian Ludwig Railway was a product of the failed, or, more accurately, non-existent, railway politics in the Grand Duchy of Hesse. Whilst the province of Starkenburg was given a central railway link, the main Neckar Railway very early on and the province of Upper Hesse at least had connections to the railway network through the main Weser Railway at its periphery, the Grand Duchy had shares in both lines and they were operated as joint railways The third province, Rhenish Hesse had no such facilities. Because the state was not active in this area, there was an opportunity for private involvement in the shape of a joint stock company The HQ of the Hessian Ludwig Railway was therefore not based in the capital of Darmstadt, but in the provincial capital for Rhenish Hesse, Mainz. The first impetus for the construction of a line in Rhenish Hesse came not however from local people, but from outside, in particular the Bavarian Palatinate was interested. For military strategic reasons the Prussian state disapproved of a route running west of the Rhine. The Grand Duchy of Baden saw the project competing with the main Neckar railway in which Baden also had shares. When, in 1844, the Bavarian government issued a license for railway construction in the Bavarian Palatinate, a northern expansion of the railway into Rhenish Hesse appeared attractive. In addition, the pioneer of the German railways, Friedrich List, personally championed the building of a line from Mainz to Worms. The Grand Ducal government in Darmstadt however, initially remained opposed, especially as it had passed a law in 1842 for a state railway system. From 1845 onwards, however, there were proponents in the government for a private railway for the province of Rhenish Hesse. Lines. Topic: Mainz, Ludwigshafen, France, 1853. At first, the route to be used was totally unclear. The alternative from Mainz via Alzey to Worms was soon discarded in favor of a direct route along the Rhine. On 15 August 1845 a license was granted to the Mainz Ludwigshafen Railway Company Mainz Ludwigshafener Eisenbahngesellschaft. The company was later renamed to the Hessian Ludwig Railway Company Hessisch Ludwigs Eisenbahngesellschaft or HLB, in honor of Louis III, Grand Duke of Hesse and by Rhine, although he initially opposed the building of the line. In the times following the HLB got increasingly into financial deep water, because several shareholders withdrew their money. Construction began in spring 1848. However, as the state purse became empty as a result of the Revolution of 1848, the state could no longer be relied on to provide any support and the construction of the line threatened to grind to a halt. Not until August 1852 did the Hesse-Darmstadt government, decided to support the HLB. In addition a treaty was agreed with Kingdom of Bavaria for the entire mainz ludwigshafen line. Whilst the city of Worms would have preferred a station in the vicinity of the port, the HLB, after a degree of toing and froing, built it further west where it is today. Thereafter building proceeded apace and the 46 km long route was opened in several sections from Mainz to Worms during the period 23 March Mainz, Oppenheim, to 24 August 1853. 
From 15 November 1853 trains ran through from Mainz to Ludwigshafen. Initially there were six passenger trains daily two of which were expresses in each direction between Mainz and Worms. In Mainz there was a connection to the steamships of the Cologne and Dusseldorf Company for steamships on the Rhine River Kölnisch und Dusseldorf or Gesellschaft für Rhein Dampfschifffahrt. Rhine Main Railway On 1 August 1858 the Rhine Main Line from Mainz via Darmstadt to Aschaffenburg in Bavaria was opened. Initially the Rhine River was crossed by a train ferry east of the railway station Mainz Neuther today, Mainz Ramisches Theater Station, until a newly designed Rhine bridge was constructed by Man Work Gustavsburg and given to traffic on 1 of December 1862. This line not only connected Mainz, second in importance after the Grand Ducal capital, with Darmstadt but it enabled also to run trains through from the Bavarian railways up the Rhine Valley to Cologne and further on to Belgium. <laughs> Expansion of the network Over the succeeding decades the following lines were added to the network and the HLB became the major provider of rail services within the two southern provinces of the Grand Duchy Rheinhessen and Starkenburg as well as one of the largest privately owned railways of Germany. West Rhine Railway Links Bahn 1859, Mainz Bingen Frankfurt City Link Line Frankfurt 1862 owned by the city of Frankfurt rail services provided by HLB Frankfurt Hanau Railway Frankfurt Hanauer Eisenbahn owned by the private Frankfurt Hanau Railway Company rail services were operated by the HLB from 1863 It purchased the line in 1872 Main Railway Mainbahn 1863 Mainz Frankfurt Worms Bingen Stadt Railway Rheinhessenbahn 1864 to 1871 Darmstadt Worms Railway Reedbahn from 1869 Darmstadt later Frankfurt Rosengarten right bank of Rhine River opposite Worms Nibelingen Railway Nibelingenbahn 1869 Rosengarten Bensheim Alzey Mainz Railway 1871 Taunus Railway Taunus Eisenbahn 1871 sold in 1872 to the Prussian State Railways Wiesbachtalbahn 1871 to 1895 Main Lan Railway Main Lan Bonn 1877 Frankfurt Limburg and Der Lan Lanches Railway Lanchesbahn Wiesbaden Niedernhausen 1879 Odenwald Railway Odenwaldbahn 1882 Darmstadt Hanau Eberbach Topic Route Numbers In the early 1890s the HLB numbered its routes as follows Line 1, Frankfurt, Hanau, Eberbach Line 2, Darmstadt, Wiebelsbach, Heubach Line 3, Mainz, Alzey Line 4, Armsheim, Wendelsheim Line 5, Bingen, Alzey, Worms Line 6, Mannheim, Worms Uber Lamperthheim Line 7, Bingen, Mainz, Frankfurt Line 8, Mainz, Worms Line 9, Mainz, Darmstadt, Aschaffenburg Line 10, Frankfurt, Hanau, Aschaffenburg Line 11, Frankfurt, Limburg Line 12, Wiesbaden, Niedernhausen Line 13, Frankfurt, Mannheim Line 14, Darmstadt, Worms 
Line 15, Bensheim, Worms Topic: Nationalization. On the 1st of April 1897, the HLB was nationalized and became part of the Prussian Hessian Railway Operating and Financial Association. The abbreviation HLB was said by the local people to stand for Hoch Lieb Bismarck, Long Live Bismarck. Topic Stock Topic Locomotives The Hessian Ludwig Railway began operations with six steam locomotives from the Maschinenfabrik Esslingen. These sported, as was then common, illustrious names: Schenk, after Freiherr von Schenk, director of the Hessian Finance Ministry; Dahlwig, after Freiherr von Dahlwig, then Hesse's ministerial director and ex-territorial commissar for Mainz. This engine hauled the first train on the Mainz-Oppenheim line. Gutenberg, after. Johannes Jens Fleisch called Johannes Gutenberg, the inventor of the printing press, Arnold Walpoden after Arnold Walpoden, the initiator of the Rhenish Bund in 1254 as well as Mainz and Worms. At the end of 1895, i.e. one year before the Hessian Ludwig Railway was nationalized, it had 216 locomotives. Coach fleet In addition to 11 first- and second-class passenger coaches the HLB had 19 third-class coaches and 36 luggage vans and goods wagons to begin with there was no fourth class. In 1861 the HLB had 39 locomotives and in 1864–52. At the end of 1895 the fleet comprised 544 coaches, 107 luggage vans, 1552 covered and 2,240 open wagons. See also Grand Duchy of Hesse Prussian Hessian Railway Company Topic Sources Hans Don, Eisenbahnpolitik und Eisenbahnbau in Rheinhessen, eighteen thirty five to nineteen fourteen Mainz, nineteen fifty seven Ralph Hauseler, Eisenbahnen in Worms, von der Ludwigsbahn zum Rheinland Fals Takt Kell, Ham, Rheinhessen, two thousand three ISBN 3-935651-10-4 Bernhard Hager, Aufsagung Dirch Pruen Oder Woltat für Hessen Die Proisch Hessische Eisenbahngemeinschaft von 1896-97. In, Andreas Hedwig HRSG, Auf Eisernen Schienen, so schnell wie der Blitz. Regionale und überregionale Aspekte der Eisenbahngeschichte equals Schriften des Hessischen Staatsarchives Marburg 19, Marburg 2008. Wolfgang Klee und Gunther Scheingraber, Proisch Eisenbahngeschichte equals Pruen Report. Band 1.2, Teal 2 and 1870 firsts 1920. Merker, Furstenfeldbrick 1992. ISBN 3 922404 383. Peter Scheffler, Eisenbahnnotenpunkt Mainz, Wiesbaden. Eisenbahn Courier Verl, Freiburg 1988. ISBN 3 88255 620 X. Topic. External links 
More information on the Hessian Ludwig Railway.